coach, uh, first of all, congratulations on uh, the point here in Lower Street. Uh, your captain, when we spoke to him at halftime, talked about defensive steely. I mean, the steely defensively, being resilient defensively. You must have been proud about that performance today. Yeah, definitely, man. Um, I think the guys work real hard in terms of um, we weren't really getting the train because the game's coming so fast that the guys can't get to recover. So our training was really on the board. We on the board whole night just learning how we want to defend, how we want to keep it organized, how we want to shift, how we want to push it up. And I think the guys, without we not training it on the pitch, we were able to work it on the board and come and execute it to take a point today. I'm really proud of the guys. Well, you, you mentioned about, of course, the tactics and not having to train, but your team looked well-oiled and well-drilled coming into this fixture. Me even had an opportunity to steal a result at the end. Uh, you'd be very satisfied with the way your front two performed as well. Yeah, I mean, we came with Phillips, and then we have Micah, who put in a good shift. And then, you know, we bring on Justin, telling me he must learn to have patience. When you get time, you will get the job done. And he definitely come on and get the job done and bring us back in the game. And I really want to say, well done, Justin. You know, we front line work together, they shift together, they support each other. And that was beautiful because I say the front line have to be a good relationship. So I believe when they finish, they're going to go and drink a little soda when they're done that. Because there's a good relationship in front day with them guys this, this, this evening. Well, thank you very much. Good. Safe journeys back to Tobago and all the best for the rest of the season. Yeah, and blessed love, man. Thanks again. Yeah? Right. Sports Max. <laughs> good coach.